You're such an asshole. All right, everybody sent me this. Uh, Captain can't write, Captain gotta do. Go work, Captain. Boy Scouts will admit girls allowing them to earn Eagle Scout rank. Not necessarily against the concept. I have a question. Why don't the Girl Scouts have their Eagle Scout rank? So the question then points out like, oh, do you have to co-op what boys do? Cause you can't do it yourselves? Let's read. The Boy Scouts of America announced on Wednesday that girls will soon be allowed to become Cub Scouts and to earn the coveted rank of Eagle Scout, the organization's highest honor. We believe it is critical to evolve how our programs meet the needs of families Interested in positive and lifelong experience for their children, said Michael Surbao, chief executive of the Boy Scouts. The scouting board of directors voted unanimously to make the historic change in an organization that's been primarily for boys since its founding more than 100 years ago. Starting next year's young girls can join Cub Scout units known as DENS. Local scouting organizations could choose to have DENS for girls and DENS for boys. Cub Scout Dens will be a single gender, all boys or all girls the organization said. So let's read that again because I'm even confused. <clears throat> Starting next year, young girls can join Cub Scout units known as Dens. Local scouting organizations can choose to have Dens for girls and Dens for boys. Cub Scout, quote, Cub Scout Dens will be single gender, all boys or all girls, the organization said. Well, that's a contradictory statement. Which is it? Separate program for older girls will be available in 2019, the Boy Scouts said, enabling them to earn the rank of Eagles. Again, I'm not necessarily against that. If the Girl Scouts do not have the facilities or leaders or ability, because remember, equality, uh, I, I would prefer that. Like, yeah, go, go be, you know. But in, in the meantime, if you can't get your shit together, fine, you can use our methods and technologies. The Boy Scouts said the moves reflect the changing nature of American life, I'd say, adding to the appeal of a scouting program that can serve the entire family. <laughs> it's so sad when an organization called the Boy Scouts forgets the first word in their title, like the girl, would the girls like the boys to come on over? I wouldn't want to interview, did you, would you think about how rude that is? You know, like, uh, if you were a boy, I want to join the Girl Scouts. Like, well, that's not, how rude, how impolite, how presumptive of you. But that's the world we live in now. It's, uh, boy Scouts of America said it commissioned two nationwide surveys that showed parents not involved in scouting had a high interest in getting their daughters signed up for both Cub Scouts and Boy Scouts. Well, that's the parents' fault. The parents should go into the Girl Scouts. Girls are now part of a four scouting programs, venturing and sea scouting geared towards outdoor activities, exploring a career-oriented mentoring program in STEM. I'm all for that. Why isn't that part of the Girl Scouts? These programs have not offered a path to Eagle Scouts for girls. This is why they need to hire asshole consulting. Earlier this year, National Organization for Women, <laughs> I'm sure, urged Boy Scouts to admit girls to the entire program. Well, I thought you girls hated boys and boy girls were equal and blah, blah, blah. Why can't uh... I just want to do what the Boy Scouts, this is coming from a young girl. She says, um, I just want to do what the Boy Scouts do, earn the merit badges and earn the Eagle Award, she told the NBC News. So here's a kick-ass girl who wants to go and do it. The Girl Scouts is a great organization, but it's just not the program that I want to be part of. I think girls should have the opportunity to become a member of any organization they want regardless of gender. Okay, and then she stepped the line where it, you're not welcome. You don't get it, it's not for girls, but now it is. Uh, has everyone been sending me, I just wanted to read that, so we had it from the word in the horse's mouth. Oh my God, what are you, oh, whoa, 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 whoa. Calm down and breathe. Let us practice stoicism. Do you control this? Now, some people took the correct answer. See, I don't control this, and I don't care because I don't have kids. And I don't have a vested long-term interest in the United States because I'll be dead 35 years. And I suggest you all get on that same philosophy. Um, but for those of you that do have kids, many of you, I, I'm surprised that some fathers still have some balls left, and you took your kids out of Boy Scouts. That is about the only action you can do. The rest of you who are upset with this, even though you do not have a vested interest in this because you're not part of the Boy Scouts or the Girl Scouts, or you have no children in either, or you just don't have children, I know you may be, eh, let's lemonade out of lemons, right? Lemonade out of lemons. You're going to do this. This is why I wrote the book, 
enjoy the decline. You're getting very angry right now. You're getting very upset. And you are lessening what few and dwindling seconds you have on this finite life on this planet. You're ruining your life. You're making yourself angry. This is going to happen no matter what. The left is going to run roughshod over the right. No one is going to stand up to them because of a lack of fathers and, and uh, nuclear families and strong male role models. And this is just the way it's going to go. Now, the institutions will collapse. The Boy Scouts, who's going to join the Boy Scouts now? No, no, no real boy is going to boy, join the Boy Scout. No one's, it's just because it's not about boys anymore. It's going to be co-opted and, and, and the leadership of the Boy Scouts allowed that to happen. Remember what I said about men with spines and balls? Well, there's none there. None there. Um, and apparently the lack of creativity, innovation, and equality on women's part is not going to be forthcoming because the Girl Scouts at any time could have came up with an Eagle Scout program. They could have mimicked completely plagiarized and lifted the entire Eagle Scout program and replicated it in the Girl Scouts, but they did Because it's not about having a club for girls. It's about having what they got. That's what it is. That's what it truly is. It's envy and jealousy. It's they got. I want what they have instead of creating it yourself. So if that makes that, 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 that. Pour yourself a drink. Go listen to some Vince Heraldi, I recommend. Maybe some Miles Davis. David Brubeck. All right? Maybe get this book online or digital. Just start reading about why you shouldn't be angry. Look, do you want to be angry or happy? Because you ain't going to control this. You ain't going to control this. And you can live the rest of your life miserable, angry, reading Fox News. And for the leftists, you can read CNN and get pissed off about Trump. You guys can land in your days of angry and you're beating your wife. <laughs> You're doing that. Fucking Trump! Gosh! <laughs> you can be pissed off like Jimmy Kimmel. You can be pissed off like the other two dweebs that are on the fake night talk shows that will never become a Johnny Carson. What are those guys? Or you can enjoy the decline. Okay? Choice is yours. You weren't born, you didn't control when you were born. You're born into the collapse of the United States. And you can, you can make it angry and try and vainly fight it when the majority of people want the United States ending. They want to destroy all the institutions. They want to destroy gender, for God's sake. That's how psycho these people are. Uh, and they want to destroy the respect for people's right to congregate as they please. Uh, you, you, you can try and fight that. It ain't gonna, it's not going to stop it and you're going to waste your time. All right? So you go have fun. You enjoy your life. If one of you is an entrepreneurial person, you could start the new Boy Scouts of America. I've often thought about starting a, a gentleman's club, not not strip club, but like a, like the, the uh, what was it, the Kingsmen, where you walk in, everyone's got ascots and smoking jackets and they're sipping cognac, and no women would be allowed. Uh, the problem is the buildings are very expensive, and that sounds like real work. And there's not, most of the American men, most Western men are pussies. It'd be a very elite club, there'd be very few people. I don't think we get enough membership to actually Plus, there's cigar lounges. That's kind of already taken on the default role. Uh, but let us use this as an opportunity to learn to enjoy the decline and not let this ruin your day and not beat your spouse. <laughs> All right. We'll see you kitties later. Toodles.